Hey, everybody. And uh, today, I want to show y'all a safer, easier way to extract the lithium out of an Energizer Ultimate Lithium Battery. Okay. Uh, these Ultimate Lithium Batteries are, are a whole lot better than the other, the other lithium batteries, I think, because it's got a... It, the usage comes down to usually a lot of times just one battery. Uh, I still like the two battery method, but I still use two batteries just to be on the safe side. And sometimes I get a lot of over lithium in what I've been doing. But what uh what I'm trying to do here is show you a way to that's safer and uh, a little bit more easier than the way that was showed on the one video that's out there about extracting lithium from the battery. Uh, what you need first is uh, you have to go to Home Depot or somewhere like that and get you a pipe cutter for tubing, uh, like copper pipe. I myself, I use a, a, a recommend Rigid, a Rigid brand. Uh, Home Depot carries them. Uh, Rigid brands, it's a, this, this is actually is a Rigid Swage Lock, but uh, that's another good brand too. They're hard to find, but Rigid's the brand that I recommend to get. Uh, they're pretty expensive. Uh, it's probably running about 30 bucks. this one right here. Uh, you put your battery, and you don't have to take the top off. Uh, that's a step that uh, usually you want to peel the whole jacket down. What you do is you put your pipe wrench or your tubing cutter in the uh, like that position. Okay, see there. All right, then you lay your battery in there. Okay, what you want to do? See here. What you really want to do is uh, get it to where. It cuts just barely into it and rolls, okay? You want to roll it and roll it and roll it until you smell a chemical smell comes out. And then follow that chemical smell, there'll come a sulfur smell. And that knows that you're down there where you need to be. At that point, stop and see if the battery rolls. See? You take it out, okay? You don't want to go too deep. If you go too deep, you'll, it'll start getting warm, okay? Then, when you, once you get it out, you can either take a wrench. You can take, a lot of times, you use both your hands and start extracting it out, see? You'll see a little spark. It means you're good. You just disconnect it. Boom. See? Boom. Voila. Be very careful that no water is around anywhere, okay? Be very, very careful of that, okay? And you just unfold it, like so. And there's your lithium, see? All in its glory. Be very, very careful with it. Take it at that time. And go ahead and top it. Cut it in half or, or fours, whatever you, however you do it. And uh, put it somewhere safe in, in a dark or denatured alcohol, or make sure it's denatured too. Or uh, I just store it in a dry spot for now, you know, and, and worry about it when I need it. But you want to do it a little bit right before you, you do what you're doing with it. And I usually cut it in fours and stick it in my little medicine bottle, which I keep over here, with my lithium. And that's how you do it. That's how you extract it, right there. And you be very, very safe with it. Put it somewhere safe. It's getting warm. It's, getting, uh, it's time to put it up somewhere, and it stinks. But that's a whole lot safer way to do it, and I'll be back. Say so, y'all.